Hi guys, um, today's tip is going to be about um, Opelu prep. So I'm wearing my Opelu shirt, got everything ready. Um, people um, always wonder um, why, or yeah, they wonder why um, we pretty successful with um, dead Opelu. And I think it's the prep that um, does it, does a lot of it. So um, when we catch an Opelu and we bring it home, um, if our family doesn't eat it and we're gonna use it for bait later, what we do is we take the opelu and here's my little opelu here, right? So we take our opelu and really important um, at first is you see his, the little anal opening here? So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna flex, I'm gonna flex my opelu and you see the doo, doo starting to come out over here? clean that off but here we go so I'm gonna flex my opelu first now this is before I'm gonna like freeze it or anything to save for later while you're flexing it the doo-doo does start to come out and then what I do too is I start like squeezing it a little bit yeah to help the doo-doo come out because you want to get as much of the doo-doo out as possible without really damaging the fish so you don't want to like you don't want to squeeze it really hard so for us, that's what I do. So I squeeze it, I flex the fish until I hear and feel the backbone kind of make a little bit of like a cracking sounds. And I'm gonna clean this off here. After I get it all nice and flexible, then I'm going to, then I'll put it inside my vacuum seal bag. And when I vacuum seal my upelus, I make sure that I put a little, um, paper towel inside my vacuum seal bag so when it's sucking out all the air the blood and everything goes and the juices go into that um, paper towel and so when, when I freeze it so it's gonna be frozen just like this um, when you make sure that you see this little fin that's sticking out here make sure when you vacuum seal it it stays nice and tight against the body yeah and then um, yeah so that's all I do then I put it inside my little vacuum seal bag with my paper towel at the end, like imagine this is a folded paper towel. I'm gonna put it at the end, fold the fin down, yeah, make sure it's there, and then I vacuum seal it just like this. So when it's time to, when it's time to um, take it out the next time, my bait will be like perfectly straight uh, because I flexed it beforehand. Um, when I, when it thaws and I have it ready, hooked up to our rig. Um, then the body will it'll swim nicer when you're like just like even at a slow paddle um, it'll swim nicer so that's all our uh, opelu tip for today uh, thank you for watching like and uh, subscribe share whatever you need to do um, i think uh, the next time gareth is going to teach you how he makes his um, opelu rigs and so i know a lot of people are interested in um, what he does too and uh, he really um, makes it simple, so that's the next time. All right, I'll see you guys later. Bye.